Hi everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how you can stream directly from your Xbox to Twitch because with the news that Mixer is going to be going away pretty soon you're going to want an alternative and I believe that Twitch is the best opportunity you've got the most eyeballs, okay you've got the most competition but all those skills you've learnt while you've been building up the community and building up your um, your subscriptions that sort of stuff on Mixer you can take to Twitch and you can start afresh and uh, another subject although I'm not going to address it in this video is my whole opinion on this is you stream to Twitch you know and then what you do is on Twitch you go on Twitch with your laptop or your computer and you use the highlight option to then export to YouTube all your best gameplay so you're building up a live following on Twitch and you're building up a subscriber base on YouTube as well so it's dead easy all you do is just go to the store and you want to search and obviously you're searching for Twitch and then you download the Twitch app and while you're doing this on your laptop or your computer log on to Twitch and you know create an account you may want to upload and you know an icon or something or put some settings in there's loads of videos how to do that um, and then you, you fire up the app now when you fire up the app the first time let's get away from you'll see obviously the stuff about um, watching twitch videos <laughs> but what you want to do is you want to log in and then it gives you a code um, so that you can go to uh, you can authorize uh, the xbox as an app that that can broadcast and then just use a d-pad to to go around and then you can just if you go to the broadcast panel you can choose things like your broadcast bar position so that depends on you know on the game you know so you're not blocking something in you can select your volumes you can if you click automatic on bit bit rate what that will do is that will work out the best bit rate for you you can change your stream resolution um, now a lot of this information it can takes from twitch itself or you can edit it here now when you're ready to go all you then do is just go into the game that you want to play fire it up so this is ace combat for example um, and then you just press the Xbox button on your controller and then just go back to the menu and then click on Twitch and literally you just click on start streaming down there click start streaming and then it fires up and you are streaming straight away how it's really really easy um, okay it's not quite as, quite as tightly integrated into the menus as Mixer um, was hopefully we'll move back to a situation where Microsoft integrates this stuff into the menus and hopefully what they won't do is integrate Facebook gaming tightly into the interview because you know I said it at the beginning of the video but Twitch has by far the most eyeballs you know people go to Twitch to watch live quality gaming content um, and that, that's why it's a very special place for that and that's also why you've always got to remember that Twitch is for live gaming content YouTube is for pre-recorded gaming content so that's why it's very important to watch some of my other videos about how you can make you um, uh, Twitch highlight clips which you can then export back to YouTube from Twitch you now you don't do it from your Xbox so that you can create a library of, of, uh, of uh, game content as well so there you go that's how you do it you basically just download the Twitch app, create a Twitch account on your laptop or on your, your computer, um, fire up the Twitch app on your Xbox, link the account, and then fire up the game you want to stream, and then go to the broadcast tab and hit start streaming. And, and that's it's, it's as easy as that. So go for it. Try not to worry too much about Mixer going away. You're going to build up just the bigger communities you had before, if not even bigger. Remember, if you've got any questions, put them in the YouTube comments down below. I'll do my best to help. I'm not that much of an expert on Twitch. I'm more of a YouTube guy, but you know, I'll try and help where I can. Anyway, that's enough from me. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you again soon.